One of the reasons we have this orchestra is that we can all gather and make music together. And I have to say again that this orchestra would not exist without the community. It's for the community, but it's also because of the community. Nothing that we have and pay our musicians or our soloists is based on anything but your donations. And we really want to thank you for that because if five years ago where we started, Nikita, you remember, we didn't think that we will survive five years. Now we are building a house in the midst of the, I would say, most problematic area in Baltimore, where people have never seen in their life violin, cello, not the kids, not the parents, the grandparents have never seen or heard classical music. And instead of going and just teach there, we are going to live there. And this is a huge project, a big dream, but I know it can happen. Somebody already gave us the property and we are raising money to finally, hopefully in five years when we celebrate our 10th anniversary, all these musicians will commit to live in this house for two years where they get all room and board paid. They have to work only two weeks of the month and work, I mean, to work in a food pantry across the street to teach in schools, to play in hospitals, in jails, in churches, in synagogues, in mosques, you name it. In two weeks, we leave them alone to become better, to just integrate with each other. But they will live in that neighborhood. People will see them walk with a violin. People will see them sit in a coffee house. We'll see them drive, we'll see them walk. That's the dream. So thank you for your support.